Hey everybody, this is Pablo with Mattress Makers. And I'm Gabe. In this episode of Mattressology, we are, are gonna talk about why mattress trial periods are worthless. So let's go. So you're talking about mattress trial periods are worthless? Mattress trial periods are worthless. Okay, you gotta, you gotta explain on that because I tend to disagree with that. Okay, maybe worthless is overdone. Maybe it's a stretch, but I would say that they're at least overhyped and here's okay. why. So I do agree it is important to test the mattress. I do believe you should test the mattress, see how it feels before you make that commitment. However, I do understand if you're not able to test the mattress, if you're not able to try the mattress, having the ability to return the mattress over a period of time is better than nothing. Yeah. It's great for peace of mind. I do, yep. I would say that. However, I do think that they are much overhyped. And again, here's why. You see a lot of the 60 days, 90 days, 100 day guarantees. Mm -hmm. You know, even sometimes you even get a year, which it is better than nothing. I do admit that. What happens after the 101st day? Well, I mean, you do think it should still be pretty comfortable, right? I mean, you slept on it for 100 days. If you kept it for 100 days, it should be pretty good. What happens after the 366th day? If it's a good quality mattress, you would think it should still be lasting, still be pretty good, right? Still be comfortable. Well, here's what we found, or at least what I have noticed talking with customers, because anybody could make a mattress feel comfortable for 100 days. Mm -hmm. Anybody could make a mattress feel comfortable for a year. But after that day, you're stuck. You're done. You know, unless it starts to break down, which usually mattress warranties, that's a whole nother topic. That's another issue that we can discuss. But just the comfort of the mattress, mm -hmm. you're stuck with it. Okay. And we see it all the time. Anybody can make a mattress feel comfortable for 100 days. I can make a $200 queen size mattress feel comfortable for 100 days. Mm -hmm. You know, I can make a $400 queen mattress feel comfortable for a year. It's not that hard to do. We've seen it done. But, and I see this happen all the time. I see mad people, they spend good money on a mattress, anywhere from $1,000 to $3,000 on a mattress. And yeah, they love it for their first year. It feels great. Uh -huh. But what happens is after the first year, it starts to soften up, the layers break down, the material starts to soften a little bit, mm -hmm. and then they start noticing, not that it's dipping, it just does not feel the same that it used to. Yeah. The second year, it feels okay, it doesn't feel that bad, but then by the third year comes around, it doesn't feel nothing like it did. Mm -hmm. you know? And actually, okay. I, I just had a customer this past week from New York, we're shipping a mattress to him to New York, he bought one of these, these beds online, and not gonna name the brand, he loved it for the first three months. Mm -hmm. It has a 100-day guarantee on it, comfort guarantee. He's on his 150th, well now he's probably on his 180th day, but he he said about 150 days in, he stopped liking the mattress. Like something happened, it did not feel anything like it did when he first bought the bed. Hmm. Okay. And I've heard that story many yeah. times. True. You know? Yeah, I've heard that too. And so my case is what's much more important than a trial period is the, and what's gonna affect the comfort of the mattress is the materials that are being used on the mattress mm -hmm. and also the way it's constructed. And that's our mantra, you see it, we talk about it all the time, the materials and the way it's constructed, that is gonna determine how long it's gonna feel. So yes, trial periods are useful, but they're not the most important thing. Yeah, I mean, they're, it, I, they're, they're important because you gotta see, hey, can I sleep on this bed for, is it gonna be comfortable for me? Right, you're buying it sight unseen, and, and even when you do come in the store, right, you test it out, you're testing it out for five, 10 minutes, and you think, okay, well, how's it gonna sleep when I'm, how's it gonna feel when I sleep on it? So, yeah, trial periods are definitely useful in those cases, right, because you don't know until you really sleep on it. Yeah. Right, but you're saying that's where it kind of like stops at, right, because how long is it gonna last? I mean, shoot, our bodies change, right? What's comfortable for me now might not be comfortable for me after that trial period. Oh, yeah. If I, you know, if I have an injury or if I have a gain a few extra pounds, lose a few extra pounds. If you, if you ever right? lose that weight, man. Yeah, if I ever, man, I'm trying. Yeah. I'm trying. If you ever, yeah. 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 So, yeah, and we say you should you should love your mattress for at least 10 years. So, I see where you're going. Like, it's, yeah, they're, they're, they're useful, right? They have its place, but what's the solution then? So, looking online and they're saying, okay, I'm shopping for a mattress. This place gives me 100 days. This place gives me six months. This place gives me uh, one year. Like, what's the solution? Should they just go for that one year and call it good or what? So, no. 
So what's more important than that, because yeah, there's a company that does like a forever warranty and I know what's inside those beds and there's no way yeah. that those mattresses are gonna True. last you forever, you True. know? Yeah, for and sure. It's, but it's great marketing. What's more important than that, going back to our mantra is first, know what's inside the bed. Like what kind of materials are in the bed? Or is it a very good high density foam? If you see a whole bunch of layers in there, I would say probably step back because you know it's not gonna feel the same a year from now or mm -hmm. two years from now if they're gonna start breaking down. Like our less is more. And I'll put a link to the video. We use latex. Latex is going to be a lot more durable than foam. Mm -hmm. But yeah, make sure that you have a higher quality materials in the bed and that the mattress is not layered with a bunch of different layers on it where it's yeah. super thick, where you know it's going to break down. So the density of the foam is very important. We're going to do a video on foam density. That is really one of the more important things when it comes to foam quality is uh -huh. the density of it. If it's like a two pound foam or greater, I feel comfortable with that. Two and a half pounds is even better. Latex is even the best. And then also just a more simple designed mattress. That's still gonna give you the comfort and support, yet it's gonna hold up. That's my solution. Instead of looking for just comfort guarantee, trial periods, look at the materials, look at the way it's constructed. So I'll take all that into consideration, right? The trial period, they're gonna take care of me if it's not comfortable, but also, is this gonna hold up after that one yes. year? So we gave a one year comfort guarantee. Does that mean we're hypocrites then in what we're throwing out there too or what? We're big hypocrites, just kidding. No. So yeah, no, we do have that one year comfort guarantee. Okay. That money back guarantee, if you're not happy, you can return it, we do do that. But we don't call it a trial period. We don't call it a comfort guarantee. We do, we, and I don't want this to sound like a commercial. We're not trying to make this sound like a commercial, but it is a 10 year love your mattress guarantee where, like I said, we, you should love your mattress for at least 10 years. And the reason why we could do the 10 year love your mattress guarantee is the way we design our beds mm -hmm. is we do it a little bit differently. We make our mattress with the ability that you can adjust the firmness. If you needed to adjust the firmness, you can. Five years from now, you can make it go firmer. You can make it go softer. Eight years from now, if you, if you liked it firm at, at one point, but you want to go softer we we can do that the reason why we could do that is because we make our mattress with a zipper top you can actually open up the mattress undo it take out the, the latex layer change it out go firmer go softer without having much waste because there is a lot of waste when it comes to when people return to yeah, mattresses there's sure. a lot of waste this prevents the waste it makes it a lot easier than having to return a bed mm -hmm. and yeah it just it just saves time the, having that ability to adjust that firmness makes it so much easier so that's our solution yeah we give you that one year period but also beyond that you, we give you that ability to adjust that comfort if you're not happy with that comfort. Yeah, we do it with that zipper cover. Yep. Right? You just take out the layer. Uh, if you need to make it firmer or softer, we just get a new layer in there. Yep. Right? Yep. And do some changes like that where you, yeah, you're not out another thousand, two thousand, three thousand dollars, right? If you know for buying having to go buy a new bed. So that's our case for the trial periods. And what other little perk on a trial period is during the holidays, if you have guests coming in and they only need the bed for a few days, then yeah, get one of those mattresses, return the bed after they're done, and then yeah, you get a free rent a bed. No. Just kidding. No. We do not condone <laughs> rent a beds. We've seen it done, that's shady. Do not do the rent a beds. I've seen it happen, okay. Yeah, not good, Just we, don't, we don't agree with that. If you guys like this video, found it helpful, leave some comments in below. I know people are gonna do this, disagree so, with this and too. And subscribe, right? Yeah. Subscribe to our there's, channel. There's gonna be people disagreeing, put it in the comments. If you disagree, let me know. I'm really curious. So yeah, thanks for watching. Thank you guys, we'll see ya.